But, so, what are we here for? I don't mean that in the big way, just, you know, right here. You're going to be in this room for a little over three hours. <laughs> what do you want to have happen? What do you want to feel? Joy? Relief? A sense that those who are gone have been honored and made present? A sense that those who are here have been given strength for the journey ahead? If you just think of this as a dry place to eat while you plan your next move, or somewhere where you might find a pen on the floor, you probably won't be too disappointed. <laughs> however you think of it now, it's probably how you'll think of it when it's over. And whoever you are, you know, out in the lobby or commuting to work, that's who you'll be on your deathbed. So push yourself a little and go easy on yourself a little. Time is your friend and time is your enemy. We can choose which for a while. This isn't three hours, by the way. <laughs> it probably won't even be one. I just said that to make life more exciting. <laughs> now you've suddenly got two free hours to do whatever you want with it. <laughs> Hooray! Call it the grandkids. Have sex with the wrong person. <laughs> just enjoy.